Hey guys, Branch John Brown here, physical therapist, CrossFit coach, and wellness coach with Get Your Fix Physical Therapy. Wanted to get on here today and talk a little bit about mindset and uh, kind of thought process that goes through my head when I'm working out as well as what I tell a lot of uh, my athletes who struggle with um, kind of just keep going and that sort of thing. So for me, when I'm doing um, some workouts, not all workouts, it depends on the movements, uh, since obviously you can only lift a barbell so many times before your muscles just get to fatigue and failure and you need that rest. But for things that are pretty much just body weight movements, so for me, it comes to um, running if I'm getting tired, um, burpees, air squats, sit-ups, things like that, that's just your body moving, that it's not really something that you're going to um, what we call like fail a rep or no rep yourself in, um, in the CrossFit world. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Things like that, literally what goes through my head is you can do five more, you can do five more, just five more. As long as you have like some workouts, like we have to do like 50 to 100 at a time. If you just keep telling yourself five more, five more, five more, it doesn't seem that bad. And you can literally just keep moving the entire time rather than you get to say 25 and it's I'm only a quarter done or I'm only halfway done, uh, whatever it may be for your total number. If you just keep telling yourself, just do five more and then all of a sudden you'll hit 20 and then just hit five more and you'll all of a sudden hit 25. Just keep telling yourself it's just five more, just five more. You can always do five more of anything. So as long as you just keep moving, keep going through that five, it's a really easy way just to kind of keep yourself out of how many you have to do total and just think about just getting those next five in and then just getting those next five in and just pace yourself out like that and it's a lot easier to just keep moving rather than uh, getting yourself or kind of getting in your head and uh, having to stop and rest while doing some of those movements. Same thing with running, hey Patrick. Same thing with running too. Uh, I tell a lot of people this that um, a lot of people in my gym that struggle with running, get really tired with running, or even myself if it's at the end of a workout, so like Murph, that last mile when your legs are dead. If you just keep putting one foot in front of the other, you're gonna keep moving forward. So as long as you just keep moving your feet, keep putting one foot in front of the other, you're gonna finish. It's just a matter of how long will it take you, which is fine, but as long as you don't stop moving and you just continue taking steps, you're gonna keep moving forward, you're going to finish what you have started out on. So obviously the body does what it does at times and wants to shut down, but assuming that's not happening, as long as you just keep moving, keep moving forward, put one foot in front of the other, you're gonna finish. So that's why I, uh, I use, the, use the phrase just keep swimming a lot. Um, from Finding Nemo, just because it's so fitting as, as as far as the, if you just keep moving, you're going to finish. You just need to keep your body moving and uh, you'll get to the end, you'll get to your finish line, you'll, um, whatever that goal may be. And it kind of works just for life too, not even thinking about fitness and workouts, but also just life. If you keep plugging away, keep pushing towards what your goals are doing, you know, breaking your big goal down into a lot of little goals, uh, breaking your little goals into step-by-steps step throughout your week, you will eventually accomplish that goal. It may take time to do it, depending on how big that goal is, but as long as you're making those baby steps every single day, keep moving towards your end game, your um, outcome, your end goal, whatever that may be, uh, you are going to make progress and you, are, you will get there. So something to think about for you guys, as far as if you're struggling mindset-wise, uh, whether it be in life stuff, in the gym, on your runs, on your, um, just when you're training. So let me know your thoughts on that. I would love to hear any feedback that you guys have on that topic. Uh, if you have any questions, definitely post those below as well. I'd be happy to answer any of those for you. And as usual, if you have any specific questions for me, feel free to reach out to me directly through Facebook Messenger. I'd be happy to chat with you. So hope you're all having a wonderful day. Have a fabulous rest of your Tuesday, and I'll talk to you guys again tomorrow. All right, bye.